Hello everyone! If you are new to my channel, my name is Leah. Welcome! Today's video is on these two makeup looks inspired by Dress to Impress. Hi everyone! In today's video, we are going to be recreating two looks from Dress to Impress. For those who don't know what Dress to Impress is, it is a video game that became popular. By the way, this is the look that we are going to try to recreate. You can play this video game on Roblox. We will start by creating a cut crease. To do this, I use a small tiny brush and this muted cafe shade. And let's create the shape. Dress to impress. I've seen there's so much hype with this game, so I decided to try it myself even though I didn't even have Roblox. I feel like the game itself is entertaining, but it's better if you play with more people, like streamers do. However, I did have so much fun creating my first looks. Talking about video games, me personally, I consider myself a gamer. Currently, I don't play anything because I've been focusing on other things. However, before I used to spend my time playing a lot. I'd say I'm a huge fan of adventure, open world games. But being honest with you, I enjoy the most with horror scary ones. How about you guys? Are you guys gamers? Let me know in the comments what type of games do you enjoy playing. Going back to the roots, when I was a kid I used to have a pinky DS Nintendo and I had many games, the Nintendogs, Animal Crossing, Pokemon or any Sonic game. Especially in summer, I remember I used to play till really late at night until it stopped working and I had to buy a new one but it wasn't the same so I quit it. Later on, I had the Wii Nintendo and had so much fun playing Wii Sports or a high school musical game that I got for Christmas. I also had a really old GameCube console in which I played Mario Kart and Super Mario Party games or I played girly games from random websites on my computer. Then, when I was a teenager, I used to play on my laptop. One of the games that I played a lot was Minecraft. I loved it and I still think it's one of the best games ever. I actually still have it on my laptop and I played not long ago because I love crafting and exploring. I think it's so much fun. Definitely Ark has to be on my list because I'm a freak of dinosaurs. I gotta admit that playing alone could be boring but to me just catching new dinos and collecting materials or crafting tools are my favorite things to do. But being honest, I was always so scared of leaving the beach and confronting big dinos that actually I didn't do much. Then I played Genshin Impact but not much because I got bored of it quite fast. I like it though. Dark Souls. This one, wow. This is so hard, I think. I suffer so much with this game because sometimes it gets super hard to do and I'm so clumsy that I don't even know where to go, what to do. And I think I broke my game in my laptop. I don't know how. Other games that I played are Uncharted. Resident Evil 2, Subnautica, Cute Girl, or Block Story. Of course, The Sims Game 2. I saw recently on TikTok that you can download it for free on Steam, so I think I may get it because I miss building shitty houses and killing humans in the swimming pool. Now that we arrived to the point in which I did my lips, I'm gonna explain what happened. I first overline a lot my lips with this eyeshadow, then I use a nude lipstick and finally I applied some lip gloss on top but then I realized that I didn't like it that much so I changed it and I did like really huge lips with red lipstick. I know, I understand, they look awful. I can see it too, but you guys need to understand that this is the thematic of the video. The avatars from Dress to Impress, they all have huge lips. So I'm trying to recreate that. I know they don't fit me. Please don't judge.
For the second look, I'm going to start by removing all the makeup that I had on my eyes. After, I'm going to add some concealer. I'm gonna blend it and set everything with setting powder. This eyeshadow is going to be my eye makeup and my blush. I also use it in the lower lash line. A bit on the nostrils as nose contour. And finally, let's finish the eye look with the lower lashes. And I added this beauty mark. This is it. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like and subscribe button if you liked it. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss anything. I recommend you to join this community because we create new looks every week. Bye!